I mean, from what I've been told in the back end is they follow all the necessary procedures, but like, I think they're probably the better ones out of them all. It's really like For where sure. they headquartered, what are they doing? Well, yeah, here's the thing with any VPN, you got to do your, you got to do your research because mm -hmm. if you don't do your research, you're probably paying for a service that's going to out you as soon as the subpoena yeah. comes in. Have you guys ever, like, fucking, um... So, how many people in the chat, real quick? How many of y'all people... How many people have, like, heard of the Culture War channels on the internet? Like, the Star Wars, like, fucking SJW Go Woke Go Broke shit? I don't uh, even think uh, I Oh, no, 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 can we get a... Can we get a... Can we... No, 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 no. Can we get a... Can we get a, like, opening here? Thank you. They brought that opening in with straight. No, you never heard of it? Like, you go on the internet and it's like fucking the channels who are like SJWs in my video games. Bro, recently I've noticed I don't think they're I've all. Ever... I don't think I know any of those channels. Maybe I'm just not cancer. No, but like, you've never come across like this video game, like fucking. There... It's been showing up in my recommendations, okay? Like, fucking channels where like go woke, go broke shit, like they're fucking leftists yeah, and Muda. invaded. Um, what it's are you fucking... watching? I'm just watching literal gaming content. Like, I just, I watched speedrunning content and it started to, like, show up in my recommendations. Oh. Like, literally, it's, like, anything gaming related, you jump into it. Like, fucking... I've never seen the biggest group of crybabies in the fucking world. It's like, ugh, oh, women in my game? Fuck me, boys. What a... Well, like, the other thing was I watched G4 TV a little bit. So, do you know the, do you know the drama around G4 TV? Yes. Um, so, I used to watch G4 back in the day when it was on, you know, when it was actually G4, you know, Attack of the Show, all that stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, Code Monkeys. I have a hot take, by the way. I don't think G4 TV was ever good. I think there were some shows like Code Monkeys that were bomb. But, like, I think... anytime, anytime motherfucking Adam Sessler and, like, any of these motherfuckers got up on television to talk about their fucking video game takes, most lukewarm, boring shit I've ever fucking seen in my life. I think... I think... it was a product of being the only thing gaming culture related on TV. Yeah. I think that's what it was. I... I agree. I think it was a lukewarm type thing. And I think it was directly the result of having nothing yeah. else in gaming culture. So, like, fucking G4 TV, all right, whatever. They can, these motherfuckers be like, top 10 underrated games on the PlayStation 2. Number one, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, okay? That's the kind of fucking reviews that you would come across with, okay? Like, motherfuckers be like, top underrated PlayStation 2 games, Silent Hill 2, all right? Sure, I guess. But, like, fucking... So, it is what it is, right? Like, motherfucker... I, these motherfuckers could not review a game worth a shit. So, anyways, let's be honest. G4 back in the day heavily sexualized the fucking women. Okay? Okay. Well, come Olivia... On. And I think they talked about this recently. Yeah. How Olivia Munn was absolutely exploited. Bro, she was the first woman I've seen with, like, ten hot dogs in her mouth. Okay? Yes. Oh, my God. Yes, she was that. exploited. Yeah! You know what? Morgan Webb. They sexualized the fuck- There was an entire segment on Attack of the Show that was yeah. Olivia's Rack. They yep, called it Olivia's that. Rack. There's something about comic books or some dumb shit. And then all yep. the fucking sudden, this is the same network that's like, Guys, we don't want to sexualize the women in our co- You fucking bred the culture, jackass! What the fuck? Like, it's Either great that you want to go roll. fucking back on it, but you bred the culture, motherfucker. Alright, you can't fucking- you can't summon the dragon and pretend it doesn't fucking exist. Alright, what the fuck? Okay, to be fair though, okay, here- here's the- here's the one thing I will say. Yeah. I am glad that they are, uh, acknowledging that that was their- that's what they did. Yeah. And look, I'm listen, that they I'm it. not going to sit here and fucking be outraged because but I was a fucking, not... I was a horny teenager. I was like, shit, motherfucker, sign me up to see Olivia's rack any day, Jesus Christ. But like, as I grow older, yeah, it's kind of, it's cringe. It is. It really is cringe. I grew older. I'm like, well, it's, it's kind of creepy. Yeah, it's creepy, you know? It's... But like, like you so... think, 
they got this one girl, Froskerin, in the and she's like a league shoutcaster. And she made she had a tirade, right? Where she's like, I don't want to be jacked off to. Don't just because like because people were shitting on her for not being as hot as like Morgan Webb or something. And it's oh. like Oh, I remember yeah, I saw I saw that, yep. She's like, I don't want to be like it's like alright, you know, something. It's she like, and she's she's like, you did it to Olivia. You did it to Morgan. Yeah. And all that. So, yeah, I, I, I remember seeing that. Yep. Yeah, and I'm just like, you know... Alright, like, Here's the I thing. get it. Here's the thing. G4 acknowledged it. Here's my issue. The people acknowledging it should not be the people who were there originally. Because the people who were there originally... Cool, fine, whatever. Yep. I think they got Adam and... Uh, Adam and Adam, I think yeah. they're both named Adam. No, um, Adam and Kevin. Kevin Pereira. Would be Kevin, 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 that's his fucking show. name. But, like, honestly, mm. yeah, they. But they like, absolutely okay, guys, is it the women in the chat? Views. In the chat, was her outburst so fucking bad? Like, she didn't want to be jacked off to. Okay, whatever. Like, granted, did she exacerbate her trolling? I agree, hundred percent. But was it like? Is it an unreasonable fucking claim? Chat, can I can I get that in the... Like, I want to ask my audience. Was it, like, so fucking unreasonable for her to say? Like, it was a fucking four-minute segment that YouTube channels on the internet couldn't shut the fuck up about till today. Okay? Till today! I'm still hearing bitching about it. Now, don't get me wrong. There's so much nuance to this, right? Like, I think it's fair to say, like, it's hypocritical that G4 is a network that wants to push, like, a reform... Yet they're the one that, in my opinion, have bred the culture. Can we agree on that, Jack? Can yeah, we agree they, that fucking... They absolutely bred the culture. Can they we were... agree that this horny fucking gamer culture... It, did, it had a fuck... That, that shit fucking was bred from G4, okay? That had its I'm gonna, place right I, there. I will say this right now. G4 is yeah. extremely important in gaming culture because they are the ones who kind of normalized gaming culture yeah. in, in, uh, in the world. Like... They were the ones who kind of pushed us forward, and then I think YouTube gaming is what yeah. really normalized the gaming culture, the nerd yeah. culture, whatever you want to call it. That being said, you don't have to agree with the way they did it. And, like, listen, the outburst that this girl made when she was like, guys, I just want to talk about, like, women in the gaming space, I'm like... Yo, it's like one four-minute fucking, like, tirade, and I already moved past it. Like, I could not give enough of a fuck about that entire time. I, I just feel like maybe maybe it's, maybe it's it is apathy, okay? Maybe it is, like, just overall. Like, I don't care. Like, if some... Like, hey, welcome to Space for All. Cool. I just find it kind of funny that G4, with their history, were, like, kind of being preachy about this shit. At the same right. time, though, like, how can, like... It's, you, you have to be such a, the anti-SJW, like, because the whole thing is like, this SJW woke shit, fucking, what is this, what does this bitch want? <laughs> fucking to be respected? Whore? I, okay, like, what the I fuck? Want, I want to say yeah. one thing on this. I'm kind of on her I side. Wanna say, I want to say <laughs> one thing on this. Well. There's so much gaming content out there nowadays. Yeah. I'm willing to bet that the average viewer for G4 is probably the people who grew up with it. Yeah. The thing is, like, even if you take the sexism tirade out of there, guys, I've looked at their YouTube channel. It is some of the most dog shit, boring fucking content I've seen on YouTube. Like, that shit's not... There, There's something about G4. It's not going to fail because of the whole sexism-like tirade. That's just controversy that was... That's probably the only thing keeping them it's alive. It's going to help them. Their content has not fucking evolved. Okay? There no, are literal it... YouTubers that are making... A hundred times better content, okay? My four-hour Metal Gear video was better content than anything the G4 TV channel was putting it out. And I was high 90% of the time I worked on that video, okay? Fucking, I'm not trying to toot my own fucking horn here, but when Adam Sessler is telling me about underrated games like God of War 2019, fuck you! <laughs> like, what? Yeah, I, th I think SJWs are terrible and anti-SJWs are terrible. Because let me tell you something about both sides. Anti-SJWs and SJWs. They're not the people actually playing the games, okay? They're the people bitching about the games. You know, I made two videos shitting on fucking, um... 
like I, I shot on Last of Us 2, but here's the thing. I played the game and I didn't even I don't even think I shit on Last of Us 2. I just said, eh, you know, it's whatever. It's a generic little third person game. Cool. There are motherfuckers that never played that game. And they've made like there's f- fucking 50 videos about how that game is woke trash. Like, The Last of Us 2 is the worst game ever made. I'd rather play Action 52. Okay, Hyperbole, chill the fuck out. It's not that great of a game, but I wouldn't say it's Action 52, motherfucker. God damn. <laughs> it's just, I don't know. It is it is dumb. It is some of the dumbest shit that I've seen. Honestly, the G4 drama has made me hate the culture war stuff even more than I already did. Because it's like, now that I'm, like, seeing it in my recommendeds and I'm seeing what people are fucking consuming and they're, like, actually getting, like, mad over, it's like, dude, how much energy, how much free fucking time do you have to get this mad over right. some internet shit, you know? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, it, it well, does here, not make sense. Here's my thing on, on that, and I don't know, it might be controversial. Yeah. Morgan absolutely, or uh, whatever the fuck her name is. I the, the new one, the Frosty yeah. or whatever. Frost, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, she absolutely means every word she says. On off. on what on her statement. Mm-hmm. Let's make no mistake about it, though. The only reason Ten that 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 clip was floated out there was because the uh, heads over at G four knew it would get traction. Yeah. This oh, isn't, yeah. This isn't some sort of fucking uh, pity me, woe me type thing. The executives at G saw that and said, oh, we can use this for media attention. Hunter, I believe that, yeah. Which sucks. And, and you know the, you know the fucked up thing about it, too? Does, it's a topic that needs to be talked about. I think what I hate about it is, like, they're talking about it in the worst ways. It's like, I want to say that, like, a... I want to say the majority of gamers are not sexist pigs, you know? Like, no, I'd agree. I, I mean, I'd say 100% of the gamers that I know are not sexist incel types, you know? In my opinion. Like, that's that's what I've seen. But, like, the weird thing is how much, like, the mainstream narrative tries to make it look like gamers just, they fucking hate women. The fucking... I'm like, all right. First off, I want to say that there's a very small minority, very vocal minority of terror, bad gamers that nobody likes. Who are pushing this fucking shit. And they shouldn't be represented. They make us look bad. You know, they really do. Fuck those guys. That's why, like, I, I talk against that shit, you know? It's, it's not... Oh, wow. What the fuck? Yeah, they're all running out. Okay. There's a difference between pandering and good representation. I, I fully believe that... I believe that... so, yeah. I fully believe that she meant for it to be good representation and the company yeah. fully uh, embraced the concept of it being pandering. I feel, listen, if I was her, okay, in this situation, I wouldn't go into like, I wouldn't yell to the heavens, you know? I'd have a civil right. discussion. I'd be like, you know, there's a, obviously a problem. Of se- it would have been so different if the clip was she rationally talked about like, there's a problem in, you know, the gaming, some game, there's a problem in gaming circles, okay, in discourse. There's a sexism problem. Yeah. Absolutely. There's some, there's some people out there, for sure. You can't deny it. Can we work on making it better and less accepted as a community? Absolutely. If she had rationally just said that, instead of going on the big rant, I don't think that clip could have even been misconstrued, you know? That's yep. what I would, I would have rationally mentioned that, you know? It's, it's really, that's really the thing. That's really how you have to tackle situations like this. It's fine to talk about it, you know, but like, I don't know. At some point, when the emotions rile too hard, people misconstrue and like re-edit the foot. It's it's fucked. It's it's wrong. It's 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 all out there. SJWs were shit. Yeah, it's the same thing. Like, listen, I think SJWs and anti-SJWs are fucking terrible. Like, if you're gonna bitch about Ghost of Tsushima uh, being a Japanese game made by Western developers. You're clearly never going to fucking play the game. You do nothing but bitch about shit your entire fucking life. And you have no enjoyment in anything. So I don't fucking care what your point is. Alright? Like, it it does not fucking make any sense to me. It's like motherfuckers who are like, I wish Call of Duty had a fucking child-friendly mode so we didn't have to see war crimes. Motherfucker, you know you can just, like, not buy the game. You can just literally not fucking... You were never going to buy the game. You're never going to give a fuck about it. (laughs) Like, what the fuck? 
Do you know that some people are asking for the GTA 6 to have I saw that. Anymore? I don't know if it's super duper serious, but like... Yeah, that's funny though. It's like, get rid of the I'm swearing sorry. in GTA, but like, keep all the violence and shit. Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. It does sound like Twitter, it, you're right. I'm sorry, nice if you're going to do that, just go play Forza or Gran Turismo. Yeah, it's like, dude, fucking load up Fortnite or play Roblox or some shit like that, dude. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> like, why? You do not need to play freaking Grand Theft Auto 6. I just play video games, okay? It is what it is.